years of horror looks where paranormal activity is surrounded all around you. This is Smithers Hall. Paranormal activity has been associated with Smithers Hall, which has petrified people across the world. Astonishingly, Smithers Hall was built 700 years ago in 1335. There were parts from the Tudor and Victorian period added onto the dark enchanted Smithers Hall. Paranormal activity happens a lot in Smithers Hall. It sometimes touches you or threatens you. George Marsh was a George Marsh George Marsh was a Protestant. He was he was also the Church of England's vicar. George Marsh was trialled at Smithers Hall. His death was on the fourteenth of April fifteen fifty five. Bloody Mary, Mary the First, wanted George to become Catholic, but George refused. The consequence, it, the consequence, the consequence he had to face was being burnt at the stake. When he was taken down, he stamped his foot in anger and said, "This will stay and be my martyrdom." People have seen a tall, dark figure drift across the floor of the George Marsh room, which temperatures dropped mysteriously in the George Marsh room or the green room. People feel ill at ease when they enter the George Marsh room. This mysterious mansion was built in medieval times in the northeast of Horses Entrance, while it has had many extensions in Victorian period. Did you know it was originally made as a manor house, although it has been made into multiple locations, such as an, old, an elderly home and nursing room. Also, in the Tudor period, they used, they used to give people trials. Trials took place in this very home. Imagine a 700 years old Tudor mansion where visitors are greeted by unexpected guests, where darkness hides around corners. This is Smithles Hall. This Tudor house was built in 1335. However, the Victorian and Tudor period, over the Victorian and Tudor period, things have changed. Originally, this ancient building has, was a manor house, but over time has also been used as an old people's home and now a grand old museum. Over the 700 years that this building, have, that this building has been standing, three families have lived in this particular place. The Bartons direct, directly and Ainsworth. Then finally, the council bought it in 1857 for £70,600. Imagine a Tudor mansion over 700 years old where unexpected events affect your feelings, where visitors dare not enter. This is Smithles Hall. Northern Bolton is where this immense colossal building stands. Some people have seen, have seen strange things, others have just heard and don't know whether to believe them or not. George Marsh was a, was a Protestant vicar. When Mary I, Bloody Mary, was reigning, she wanted everyone to become Catholic, but George refused, so he was burnt at the stake on the 14th of April. 1555. Before this happened, he was tried at Smithers Hall. Mysteriously, visitors to the hall have observed a tall man that looks just like George Mars. Also, there have been ropes swinging and doors closing in the room where he was trialled.